I'm Ty Quinones and right now on your 13 Action News update. Well, happening overnight, well, a person now is dead after their motorcycle is hit by a car. Uh, this happened right around 715 last night at Warm Springs Road and Pollock Drive. Police say the driver of a Buick was making a left turn when a motorcycle reached that intersection and they collided. That motorcyclist was taken to the hospital where they later died. Metro says the driver of the Buick showed no signs of impairment. Police now say this is the 11th traffic related death in their jurisdiction this year. Well, we are also learning new details right now about the shooting at a Chinatown restaurant. Police are now revealing hospital staff are the reason the suspected gunman is now behind bars. A court documents indicate that Rashawn Gaston Anderson was treated for injuries to his hand on December 20th. But that is hours after a waiter was shot at Shanghai Taste. Now, police identified Anderson as a suspect and say the hospital staff recognized him on the news. Well, last check, the victim who was shot multiple times is expected to be OK and is at right now a rehab hospital. It is an action day, big time wind, big time cold air temperatures feeling close to freezing this morning with some 40 mile per hour gusts, even stronger wind over in the Colorado River Valley and up in the mountains. The high today only 49. Todd, we may actually have a wind chill during the afternoon with sunshine where it feels like the upper 30s. So bundle up low 50s Thursday, mid 50s by Friday. Yeah, it is still winter. All right, Justin, thank you. That was your 13 Action News update. You can always find more information on our website at KTNV.com.